Okay, so now that I've shown you the basics of Flash, uh, what I'm going to show you now is how to do a classic tween and what that does. And I'm just going to use a bouncy ball as an example. So first of all, we're going to select these and we're going to delete that because that was just an example. And then we're going to come over here to one of the oval tools and we're going to make a ball just here. Right? So we've got our ball and we're going to create a line and you can just change the width of that line to 4 that's usually thick enough anyway so I'm going to create a simple line across the stage and it's a little bit big so you can just use a free transform tool and you can actually just change the size of that to whatever you want. And you can move it around, do whatever you want with it. So now we've got our line on our ball. And we're going to want this to actually bounce up and down, up and down. So I'm going to change the properties of the stage to be a little bit wider to 600 and then to about 500 height so we'll move this a bit lower or you can actually just you can move it up and down or you can have a, a bouncy surface like that or one like that I think this looks a bit more fun so we'll actually just use it like this so here's our ball right so the first thing you want to do is you want to have these on separate layers so we'll cut this first right click cut and then insert a new layer so for that new layer we're going to insert the ground that's going to be our ground for this exercise so make sure everything that you do as in if you're going to add another feature or another ball you always add another layer and always name your layers it just makes everything so much easier so you can see we've clicked on layer 1 and that's been highlighted and we've clicked on layer 2 and that's been highlighted so we're going to name this bounce ball and we'll name this our bendy ground right and what we'll do is we'll click on frame 50 or 51 and we'll click shift and select both of them and then we want to insert right click insert a keyframe so once we've done that now this area here from frame 1 to 50 this is going to be where our tween will be and which will allow this to bounce up and down up and down so we'll click on frame 25 just in the middle and we'll insert a keyframe here and we'll put this over here so you can see on frame 1 it's up there on frame 2 it's down there and frame 50 it's up there sorry 25 and 50 so that's the three sections of our ball moving up and down so now what we'll do is we'll click here and we'll insert a cl classic tween so create a classic tween right click create classic tween here and also create a classic queen tween over here as well so now if we just press play You can see it moves up and down. That's just a basic classic tween. And now, well, what I want to show you is just how to make it a bit more realistic. So it looks a bit blocky as we can see just up and down. So we'll click on about here, frame whatever that is in between 10 and 15. 
and if you click here you've got your easing tool so you can actually ease in or out so in this case we're going to go to about 100 in and if we click here we'll ease 100 out so that should give it a bit more of a realistic look and it should bounce a bit slower at the start and then come up a bit faster so we'll test that out now and press play so if you did see it just did um, just kind of stopped and then went back up a bit quicker so that's just the basics of classic tune and the using function thank you bye